It's said that if two bullets are released from the same height, one fired and the other simply dropped, they will hit the ground at the exact same time. The theory holds that gravity affects both projectiles equally, so they should land simultaneously. To test this, the Mythbusters began with a small-scale experiment. Instead of real bullets, Adam used steel balls. First, he dropped one steel ball from a set height, then launched another horizontally using a spring-loaded shooter. A high-speed camera captured the exact moment each ball hit the ground. The dropped steel ball took 402 milliseconds to land, while the spring-launched one hit in 410 milliseconds. Next came the real-world test with actual bullets. The first crucial step was to determine how far a bullet fired horizontally from a handgun would travel before hitting the ground. They mounted a gun precisely 36 inches above the ground and fired it across a shooting range. By placing wooden boards at different distances, they tracked the bullet's drop. They calculated that the bullet would land at about 360 feet. Armed with that data, they moved on to the final large-scale experiment inside a massive 480-foot indoor facility free from wind interference. Jamie designed a platform to release the second bullet using an electromagnet. The biggest challenge was ensuring the dropped bullet was released at the exact moment the gun fired. However, residual magnetism from the electromagnet caused delays, so they switched to a solenoid, but that proved too slow. After four hours of trial and error, Jamie came up with a clever idea. He added a small metal hook to the gun's trigger. This delayed the shot just enough to perfectly sync with the solenoid's release, achieving an astonishing timing difference of only one-third of a millisecond between the two. The drop platform was then placed at the 360-foot mark, directly in the path of the fired bullet. If the myth held true, both bullets should strike the ground at the same time and at the predicted landing spot. The test began, and the result was a scientific triumph. The fired bullet left a clear skid mark as it hit the ground. Slow-motion footage confirmed that the two bullets landed with only a 39.6 millisecond difference, so small that the human eye could never perceive it, thus confirming the theory.